Good day, everybody. Michael Posnick here, Century 21 Northumberland, your high definition real estate agent. Today, we're northeast of Charlottetown, looking at three new listings in Greenwich Dunes Estates, which is across from Redhead Harbor. Uh, Greenwich Dunes Estates is situated within a federal national park located next to the mobile sand dunes, which there are very few of in the world. Now there's two other videos I did of Greenwich. One was on a lot I had for sale. We've just sold that. So we have virtually no inventory. In fact, these three lots are the last ones that I have available. They're contiguous. So it's an opportunity to own three lots side by side, which will give you an abundance of property in one of the top subdivisions on the entire island. Let's go take a look. This is a view of Greenwich from Redhead Harbor. Redhead Harbor is right across St. Peter's Bay. See the mobile sand dunes coming up here shortly, background. This is uh, Redhead Harbor Wharf that we're standing at, which is right across from uh, Greenwich. So essentially what we need to do is we need to go over this brand new, newly constructed bridge through downtown St. Peter's. And we're just gonna proceed straight through and then Greenwich is up on the uh, turn left which will bring us into the Federal Park. So there's an inn here, there's a pizza place, a bunch of restaurants, crafts, giftware, you name it. We're just going to turn left here up at the top of the hill. We're on 16, turning left onto 313 or heading west. Look for this very well-constructed for sale sign. So Greenwich is just a couple miles down this road. So just down the street from our uh, subject property is the Inn at St. Peter's. Gourmet dining, four stars according to the sign. So there's a restaurant down here, a bunch of rental cottages. The landscaping is absolutely phenomenal. I don't know how they keep up with it. Full-time job just pulling the weeds. So here's the Inn. Very well known for gourmet food in the area. The area is also known for world famous Lynn's Takeout. So Greenwich Dunes Estates just starts up here where these metal telephone poles are, if you can believe it, courtesy of the federal government, I'm assuming. And in front of us is the um, multi-million dollar interpretive center built just to facilitate the information disbursement about Greenwich uh, Greenwich and the St. Peter's area. Go in there and you can watch movies, they've got all kinds of information on the area, there's uh, apparently Aboriginal history, whatever else, can't remember, but it's all in this building here. So that's well worth the, uh, the trip to just check this out alone. So Greenwich Dunes Estates would just run along the right hand side here. And then in front would be the entrance to the, uh, the beach. So this would be the entrance to the uh, National Park here. So these are the showers and the entrance to the boardwalk to the beach. And that would be Greenwich Dunes Estates just to our right and behind. So swimming is supervised here. And that's the boardwalk which brings us to the beach and the sand dunes. So that's the boardwalk we just walked up on. Those would be sand dunes, the mobile sand dunes. Behind that is fabulous beach for many miles. Some information on the uh, sand dunes here, just before we get to the beach. There's your uh, water and wind temperatures today. Tides high and low, kind of a windy day. So 
So we're just coming back from the beach. We're going to go up on that tower there. Get some aerial photography done. So that's the parking lot we came in. We're standing on the top of the tower here. That's a view of the beach. Sand dunes. The boardwalk we walked to get there. They're just sweeping over to the east. Continuing our sweep to the east. This is Greenwich Dunes Estates. Looking towards the bay and the way we came in. And that's the road we drove up to get to the park. So way in the distance is the interpretive center on the bay. The road we drove up. Greenwich Dunes Estates on our left. Parking lot where we parked. And then back to the bathrooms and the boardwalk from the parking lot or walkway. So we're just leaving the uh, parking lot here at the Provincial Federal Federal Park. And we're just going to pull into uh, Greenwich Dunes Estates here and do the 50 cent tour. This lot on the left is the one that just sold. It's going to head to the north. The, uh, the showers, and that's a picnic area, an enclosed picnic area to the left of that building. Greenwich Dunes Estates is all underground services from what I understand, although I haven't verified it. There's fiber optic cable through the whole place as well for up to the state-of-the-art communication systems. This would be the north east corner. little cul-de-sac here. There's a large pond behind us. We're in this corner here somewhere, probably more towards the east. So our subject lots should be right along here somewhere on the right. So the subject lots are in here. I didn't bring uh, the GPS coordinates because the internet was down this morning, but I should be in the right area. So that's our three lots in Greenwich Dunes Estates. Thank you very much for watching my video. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel and for weekly updates, PEI real estate tips, tricks, and traps, make sure you subscribe to my newsletter at michaelshomes.com. Thank you, have a great day, and remember to buy it right. <laughs>